Thank you so, so much for your beautiful and kind words. And the reason we are who we are today is because we all believe in the Armenian culture. We all believe in our youth. And the excitement, if you were there yesterday, I was on my feet for seven straight hours, nonstop rehearsal between group one, group two, group three, until our really senior dancers. And uh, what I can say is like, they're so excited, everybody. Everything is gonna be so beautiful and we are pretty much ready, I can say. And uh, the program is gonna be filled with surprises, small and big. Especially we have with us, we're proud and we're extremely, extremely honored that we are having this opportunity to have as guest of honor our uh, composer, Armenian composer, Ara Kevorkian in person. Beautiful. And uh, you have no idea. And uh, If somebody like Ara Kevorkian, who was in our audience in Armenia, and he said to me, uh, Seda, the only dance that I did not scream bravo was the remember because he said I was literally crying people around him they saw him literally crying and remember why remember because our program we dedicated this program to uh, call, to be called like remember 1915 mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. about a year ago when Ara had uh, done his clip of beautiful presentation of uh, the remember song I mean the music he sent it to me and he said, Seda, this is something you may use. And I listened to it until four o'clock in the morning because I really wanted to do something. And I'm so, so happy that our you'll see about like 50 members in this dance, as young as four and a half years old until up to middle age. And uh, when you see them like performing and with tears in their eyes, uh, I don't know what to say, Vartan. It's going to be an amazing, amazing program. And especially Ara, towards the end, he has a fantastic presentation. It's worthwhile just just to come to see that one dance and Ara's performance. I mean, everything else is going to be excellent. Of course, as I said, like we have the best of the best. Uh, and I'm very, very proud and happy to say we have a lot of talented Armenian uh, groups around. And yes, we have a very busy schedule. but. If somebody like me, who was on their feet seven hours and went last night to see Nune and encourage other dance groups to be there, uh, I think everybody can do it. If I was able to do it yesterday, Vartan, everybody will be able to do it. Where there is a will, there is a way, Seta. And let me ask you to just quickly name the many, many beautiful artists and what they do will be participating in tomorrow's program, in next week's program? Well, the best, best artists are my Shushi members, obviously, and there are over 100 members from age four and a half Beautiful. to, as I said, mid, uh, whatever, age. I don't want to call yeah, uh, Some of the them, adults are also I talking. know, I don't want to give their ages, but it's fine. They're beautiful members, and they're really, really working so hard. As much as they are perfect, excellent dancers. As a matter of fact, right now, as I'm speaking, they're still practicing on their own because they want to do it perfect. We want to make sure every little thing, especially the beginning of the program, it's nothing to be missed. And it's going to be so moving. And uh, it's going to be starting with Hasmik uh, Mehanejan. That's a new surprise. She'll be reciting. And the program, uh, as you just heard, Hamlet, I mean, I'm sorry, uh, Andre. Andre. I have so many of them, so I hope I don't forget any one of them. And uh, Hamle, uh, Andre is going to be live. This is the first time Andre is in our area on the East Coast. And he's a, one of the biggest, biggest names that we have currently. Some people maybe they have not heard of him, but he's amazing. He's going to be dancing on the floor, on the dance floor with uh, the, the group. And of course, Hamlet, no words for him. He gave us a special... Uh, performance when we arrived at the uh, in Moscow uh, with five songs it was so so beautiful and that's when I said no I'm bringing Hamlet there uh -huh. so which was good and uh, Leila Sarimbekian oh. and I'm sure you of you have Absolutely. all heard the, with the short bar her famous and of course the dance group is going to be dancing around her and with Skype I've been teaching her what dance group moves so that mm -hmm. we can do it all together. That's going to be very exciting. 
Armen Hovanesian is not a new name, and especially in Armenia, like when they hear Armen Hovanesian, every single Armenian, they love him because he really truly delivers uh, the songs in the most beautiful ways. And I'm so, so happy that they've toured with us, South America, Middle East, they've, uh, Moscow, everywhere with us. And the same with Salpi Maelian. And they will be flying from Los Angeles. And uh, Hasmik Mehanejian, Anahid Zakarian from the diocese. You cannot be missing them from uh, New York. And especially Solange Merdinian, she'll be flying from she Korea. Is, oh She's God. right now uh, performing in Korea. She'll be arriving tomorrow. And uh, as I said, like with the dance group, uh, the energy that it is, and with our new choreographies that we have in our program, because we have to do dances with the singers. So, or more or less, like, it's not a very new program, but we have some classic dances in our program that we cannot say we don't want to do it again. Overall, how has the at attendance and the enrollment uh, uh, within Shushi uh, family been last year? Well, especially this year, because of course we have a lot of dance groups, and uh, which is great. And I encourage all members, all the dance groups, good luck. I wish them good luck. And of course, we, everybody tries to do the best we can. And of course, you know, it's not easy. Thing. Mm -hmm. it's, it's a job that you can spend probably 24 hours. It's never enough. And uh, the, this year especially, I think after our tour, and like the first question when the new member comes in, when is our next trip? Mm -hmm. overseas not even like domestic overseas you know <laughs> it's exciting so it is exciting that this year we had a record of 20 members which is a lot for us because we do have a membership and it is pretty high membership but the costumes that you're going to be seeing tomorrow on stage Thank it's you. like unbelievable all of them are made and especially like Arake Borkan is going to bring the last shipment with him mm -hmm. he's such a humble such a nice person to know as a friend and a friend of Shushi. When are they coming, all of them from Armenia? Well, we have them in three shipments. <laughs> Sorry <laughs> to say shipments, but uh, Arake Borkan will be arriving here at 1.30 next Thursday. Thursday. And uh, Andre will be arriving at 9.30 at Kennedy Airport. We have to go twice to Kennedy Airport in one day, which is no problem. And uh, the California uh, singers and Andranik Moradian, of course, he's our musical director which I've worked with him for 13 years and the most professional person, the most honest person, musician, sound engineer. Is, we've been working with together and I'm so, so happy that they're able to come. So it's going to be exciting week for me and I took like seven days of my vacation days just to please them and take them to New York and uh, give them a tour of uh, our city. Sarah, you just said going to JFK twice in a day is no problem. <laughs> now, obviously, when you say it's no problem, you must have an army behind you to support you. Tell us about that organization. Of course. Anytime, no matter how you, you are talented, how what? much you can do, if you don't have people working with you so honestly and all the time, we don't look at the time, no matter what time of the day, they're ready to help you out within their schedule, within their busy, busy schedule. Obviously, anything like this, as much as like I am behind this entire, uh, let's say, army, but uh, you can't do it without them. And of course, I have to mention it, which you stole her from me a little bit, Talin Kupelian, and uh, she is like, between the website, the booklet, day and night, we're together like, uh, arm to arm, she asked me if I can give her my house key even. No. So my daughter-in-law, she said, if Seda doesn't give it to you, I'll give it to you. So don't worry about oh. it, which was nice of her. And uh, sure enough, she'll have the key soon. And uh, we're going to have a guest party next week. And it's going to be like exciting. I don't know what to say more, Vartan. I'm so, so proud of every single member, all the parents that they've been bringing their kids to rehearsals two, three times a week now that it's approaching to the performance, but they are very cooperative. And I must say, Shushi members and parents, they have learned not to come to me and say why my daughter is not in this dance. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Because they know I'm there, I'm the one who's spending the most time. And for me, every single member mm -hmm. is as important as the little one or, or the older one. And we look more for, we want to make sure everybody looks the best on stage and the most professional. When people pay $100 for our tickets, which we have 
oversold the hundred dollar tickets and fifty dollar tickets they want to get their money's worth and this one is going to be a steal uh before we go to a song Seta, can you please just talk to the families who are listening to you and tell them why they should come to the performance and what can you say for them to be there you have said a lot but just before we go to songs the reason they have to come first of all Artan, it's because let them see what kind of production this group which it runs with non-professionals i don't call myself professional and the team that i have no none of us get paid we all volunteers it's hard to believe that the dance group in this magnitude we can do a volunteer work and uh, it's so professionally done. If we are able to perform at the opera houses, uh, in all the places that we've been, and touring the world, and I just say thank you to all the members, thank you to everybody, uh, parents. Without you, obviously I can't do it. If you don't bring your children, I can't teach the chairs, empty chairs, obviously. So I'm very grateful for everyone, even if they help me with one second. Every second helps.